All right, so my prediction for the fight is Logan Paul is going to win. Because, first of all, if you see KSI had the Joe Weller fight to prepare for. So, like, KSI has already been boxing longer than, than Logan Paul. So, and then Logan Paul only had, like, a few months or I can't remember, like, a year or something. So, like, KSI has already been boxing way longer. And then he, he, like, barely scraped out a tie against Logan Paul. So... That's another thing. And what else? The reach advantage. The reach advantage is not going anywhere. Like KSI, I mean, Logan Paul dominated KSI in the first few rounds because of that reach advantage. And I think that like this, KSI relied on Logan Paul getting tired. And this this fight is not gonna go as many rounds as, as, as the original one because they're lighter um, boxing gloves and there's no headgear so someone's gonna get fucked up a lot quicker so that's another thing um what else was I gonna say yeah another thing is like I know some people have been sparring you know KSI so but they they haven't got anyone I don't think that's like Logan Paul's height and like I said that reach advantage is gonna be like of a key thing in this fight and like I said they, they I don't think they got anyone who's like Logan Paul's height to spare uh, to spar so that's another thing is like yeah like oh he's so good but then like dude the, have you got someone Logan Paul's fight to spar him like 6'2 like like they're getting people that are like a lot shorter or maybe his height I don't know but yeah that's another thing anyway uh, I think Logan Paul's gonna win this um, fight so whatever if if he ends up losing it's um yeah i guess jj really put in the hard work but 